Well, hello everybody. This is me, Be Divine, and we are going to just take a look what this full moon in Virgo is going to bring for us. Um, I usually have a nice little spread that I do, but today I'm just going to open it up to see what happens. And just quietly, in case you weren't watching um, some of my um, TikToks or anything like that, I have, um, firstly, I'm a uh, accredited um, executive practitioner of uh, holistic medicine. Now I'm actually, oh my God, a training provider. So all of my courses became accredited. So it wasn't just me that was accredited. Now all of my courses, semester one through three, anything that I'm teaching at my Teachable Academy um, is all accredited, which means you get an accredited certificate and you're also, as a student, able to then apply for accreditation yourself through my accredited number. So this is huge. Like, I can't even explain to you that I'm being recognized in this industry. They needed to look at my, um, what the heck? What? It's a long so they needed to look at my um, curriculum, et cetera, and things that I've been, oops, things that I've been teaching. And, uh, Wow. And then, um, so they didn't even see semester three, but they accredited that anyway, because of the, all of the um, study that I offer you all. So, oops, sorry, everybody. Okay, so I'm just kind of, yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> and it's nice to be recognized in this field um, all right so let's get going what are we letting go of with this full moon what are we letting go of with the full moon and even my tarot course is accredited as well just so you know um, <laughs> what are we what are we letting go of okay so we'll just start with that what we're letting go of hey the hangman came up here, um, released. It's upside down, so we are letting definitely letting go, letting go of restrictions and things that were holding us back, and you know, moving into this brand new um, energy of good news coming in instead of negative news like we've had. So we're letting go of past pain, heartaches, and stresses, and allowing this beautiful energy to start coming in for us. Um, and then what happens? Oh my God, look, we've got these upside down cards. So we're releasing ourselves from our own restrictions. Moving forward fearlessly into our new future. Because um, Saturn is going to be moving into uh, Aquarius, uh, sorry, Pisces, which is today as well which brings a lot more peaceful and spiritual energy. And then we've got Pluto going into Aquarius. So we move into the age of Aquarius, which is like, wow. Anyway, um, so very quickly, things change. Okay, we release ourselves, and things change. What else comes forward from this? Oh my God, see, this? I didn't reverse any of these cards intentionally. So they're coming out how they're meant to. So we're released from not knowing. We start to see the truth, right? Now from here, what's going to happen because of that? Oh my God. We have this beautiful um, energy of the high priestess. So we just have a knowing of what we need to do and where we need to be. Everything starts to work out a little better for us. And the camel always shows us perseverance here as well. Oh my God. A new emotional and spiritual start is here for all of us. I'm going to feel so much happier within. And we start to take on our leadership connections here. Now, some of you are moving into a relationship that's more permanent. Some of you are moving into a um, more of a new uh, pathway for yourself. And some of you are really opening up to divine love and connection with others on the same wavelength. Okay, and then what? 
Okay. Wow. There will be some really, really major things that take place as well. If you remember, I was telling you all there will be explosions. Now, there's just, this to me is a tearing down of this energy of loss. It's a tearing down of this and there's a trusting presence um, around us, you know, focused on truth and light and new direction. Full moon is right there with this energy. So what is the tower, please? Tell us more about the tower. Okay, we will have something communicated to us. Again, this full moon, something very important, important communication. Tell us about this important communication. Look, see, it just comes in, uh, it's news, okay? It's on the news, maybe. Maybe there's going to be something that really gets exposed, right? And we, we finally see the truth of the situation. What actually starts to become exposed? Okay, again, the full moon. Something from um, another something that we might or someone we might have turned our back on and it comes from someone who's from a different place they're from overseas um and uh, it brings in our true prosperity like there's many of us that have been missing out we're finally going to start seeing our guidance so what comes from all of this news and information for us all beautiful energy of the queen of cups what's coming for us the beautiful energy of strength and recovery. Oh my God. And we walk away from abandoning our successes. So full moon, full moon. I mean, how many full illuminations do we need here that this is coming in because of this energy? And there's a lot of health energy here as well. So some of you focused on um, healing yourself as well. Getting rid of people that were ripping us off. The moon, the moon, the moon, the moon, the moon. So these things come up and we have victory. So this comes up with this full moon in this coming cycle of two weeks. And what was hidden is now on the surface. This brings us a great victory. And someone who thought they were getting away with what they were doing to try to destroy us not going to get away with it because they're just walking into a trap okay so what's the overall outcome here my god look at that justice being done um release of the old uh something that was unbalanced being restored we have the energy of the lion coming through the readings and the red of our root chakra. So this connecting with the physical as well. Justice will be done. It's going to be served. And it's going to be served quickly. And bringing in the abundance. No more struggles. You still may have to deal with a few things. But the end is here. The end. The ruin of this negligent energy that has been around us for so long and the final beginning uh you know of wow look that was underneath the beginning of our abundance and our own dominion so our own powerful energy comes forward like we are really guided and protected here and things are going to really shift out into our favor right so let's get some of these little angel answers. So what happens now? Let's get a look real quick. I know I need to do my nails, but <laughs> I haven't had time. Okay. So we have a no, we have improving health, and then we have asking for help from others. So what's this no about? We No, we need to remain positive. <laughs> okay we'll do it we need to remain positive we need to take action for our dreams and our goals rainbows are here reconsider something okay what are we reconsidering 
It's up to us. Okay, so we don't want to be in that, oh, I don't know, oh, I'm thinking about it, oh, oh, oh. We have to stop procrastinating because uh, within the next few weeks, many things are um, about to shift for us, right? Now, um, I want to thank you all for being here. And um, I've got more readings, of course, for us. The final thing that I want to do is this um, spirit of the animals here. So, um also, I'll be taking phone calls with you soon. Um, if you want to talk to me about uh, the Academy of signing up, today's the last day for it to be half price. Otherwise, you're going to have to use your, your um, patron discounts, which is fine. We can work out payments and things. Okay, so let's go. We have the Peacock. Vibrancy, you were born to shine and inspire. Practice humility to avoid jealousy. Be grateful for life and be good and the good things will come. Be true to yourself and recognize your own brilliance. I love the peacocks. No joke. <laughs> and one more message for us. Oh, our dog friend. Today I'll love without condition. My energy, enthusiasm are an inspiration. I choose to be happy. I am a protector and a friend. Okay, some of you may have animals coming into your life very soon. Okay, they bring you wisdom and strength as well. All right, everybody, I'm going to get this going for you and I'll see you real soon. Bye for now.